Hey everyone, this is John. Welcome back to another review with me. Today I am back in the car to do a fast food review. This is a new uh, item from Taco Bell. You can see the logo with not too much shine on it. I'm make this as quick as I can because I'm going to be sweating soon in this heat. But Taco Bell, back to the the point at hand. Taco Bell has a new item on their menu called the Grilled Cheese Burrito. Um, this is another example of Taco Bell taking the same ingredients, rearranging them in a different pattern, calling them something new, and me buying it. Um, in this case, all they've done is taken some of the cheese from the outside of a burrito and put it on the outside and then grilled it. Oh, it even has like a second interior wrapper. I bet this this paper feels like a parchment. I bet they have to wrap it in this and then put it on the grill so the cheese doesn't get on the grill. And here you can see all that glorious bean footage. I think there's a smudge on my camera. There we go. Does that look better? See, on one side there's nothing, but the other side you have this cheese. And that's basically the difference. It does smell like a milky grilled cheese, so let's give it a taste. They really sauced up the interior of this. And I took a bite from the non-grilled cheese side. Even with all that in the middle and tasting it from the non-grilled cheese side, I still get this like burnt cheese flavor that you get it from uh, uh, from that. I'm going to go ahead and taste it from the other side. I like how there's two tomatoes that got grilled on the outside with it. You know, this, uh, the browning on the cheese here, you can see it's wrapped around basically the t one half of it. That does give it a different, unique flavor than wrapping cheese around something else. You have the quesarito that has the cheese on the interior. You had the cheesy core burrito that had like just like the middle was all cheese. And really, if you took a bite of those two things, being the same ingredients, uh, being on the inner circle or the outer ring doesn't really make much of a difference. But with the cheese on the exterior, with that grilled cheesiness of it, it does actually taste different. It tastes unique. It doesn't really taste like a grilled cheese sandwich, but you do get that uh, caramelized browned cheese flavor. They do put a whole lot in the middle of this, which is kind of, to me, that's kind of disappointing. I think the they should redo this and make the middle more simple. Just like meat beans and rice but the cheese sauce and like there's like a some kind of nacho cheese mixture in there like a mayo based sauce and that really uh overpowers it and um kind of takes away from that grilled cheese flavor it still comes through which is good but i wish like there was more emphasis on that flavor that wasn't covered up by the interior Very good for just taking the new, the same old ingredients and putting them in a different order, wrapping it in parchment, then grilling it. It adds another dynamic to uh, what D Taco Bell already does well. And um, really, yeah, the interior is the only thing that I have to say could be improved. I do like that cheese. 
It'd be interesting if they did all the way around with cheese. Um, maybe with that, you could even still keep the interior here and have um, more of that grilled cheese flavor, and it wouldn't be that much of a, an issue because there would be more of it. Um, but as is, I'm going to give this grilled cheese burrito from Taco Bell an 8 out of 10. That's the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Until next time, guys. Bye.